Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell so you never miss out on our latest tech tutorials. Today, I'll be showing you how to customize the taskbar in Windows 11. Let's get started. First, we need to access the taskbar settings. Right-click on any empty space on the taskbar and then select Taskbar Settings from the context menu. In the taskbar settings, you can change the alignment of the taskbar icons. By default, they are centered, but if you prefer the classic left alignment, you can change it easily. Find the taskbar alignment option and select left from the drop-down menu. Next, let's customize the items that appear on the taskbar. In the taskbar settings, you'll see a section labeled taskbar items. Here, you can toggle on or off various features like search, task view, widgets, and chat. To add or remove icons from the taskbar, you can pin or unpin apps. To pin an app, find the app in the start menu or search for it, right-click on it, and select pin to taskbar. To remove an icon, right-click on the app icon on the taskbar and select unpin from taskbar. Next, change taskbar color and transparency. To change the color and transparency of the taskbar, go to Settings, Personalization and Colors. Scroll down to find the Transparency Effects toggle to make your taskbar transparent. Under Choose Your Color, select Custom to set the default Windows mode to Dark or Light and the default app mode as per your preference. You can also choose an accent color to apply to the taskbar. Taskbar Behavior Settings There are additional behavior settings you can customize. In the taskbar settings, scroll down to find the taskbar behavior section. Here, you can change options like automatically hiding the taskbar, showing badges on taskbar apps, and choosing which corner of the screen you want your taskbar to be on. And that's it! You've now customized your taskbar in Windows 11 to better suit your needs and preferences. If you found this tutorial helpful, please give it a thumbs up and share it with others who might benefit. Let me know in the comments if you have any questions or if there's another tutorial you'd like to see. Don't forget to subscribe for more helpful Windows 11 tips and tricks. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.